I'd like to introduce Miles Kessler from the Integral Dojo. He's based in Tel Aviv, studied for many years in Japan, Buddhism as well as Aikido. He's also putting together an electronic university, so I invite you to check out his work as well as hope that you enjoy our time with him here. Miles, thanks for being with us. What is Aikido? <laughs> so the best answer that I can give, you know, I mean, Aikido is something to experience, yeah? And that's the beautiful thing. What I came to understand was, was, was a authentic spiritual practice. And I mean that, I, I say that in the sense that the practice, that the techniques that I was doing, the methodologies that I was practicing would lead you to an authentic spiritual realization. Whereas the techniques have that potential, but it's not, it's rarely being practiced that way. And it's, a, and it's actually a lot of, it's a big kind of roundabout way to get to it. You know, uh, in Christianity, there's a saying, um, I guess a saying from Jesus, when two of you come together in my name, I will be there. And uh, it's really beautiful. So when two people come together, really come together in the spirit of Aikido, where I think Aikido has its greatest gift to humanity in the field of conflict, when we actually come together with that spirit of Aikido, there's an intention to actually come together in a higher way. Um, when we really bring that in, it will appear. And that has a transformational effect on any, on any conflict. So, and I know I mean, this is what you do in your work. I've seen you do it live and, you know, and I've done it with you. But it's, it's just an amazing thing. When two of us come together in, in, in my name, I will be there. I see that as one of the, one of the kind of common mistakes in, in, in the Aikido culture is that there's a little bit of avoidance of, of, of conflict because no, no. We're, we're walking the path of love, peace, and harmony. So we have to kind of not really get into it and fight and argue and, and uh, mix it up. But underneath, there's all this passive aggressive shit that's flying around the room. And it's like, okay, whatever. I think that Aikido actually is the next step where um, we come together with our differences. Our boundaries bump, bump into each other. And, you know, with our practice and with our skill and to a large part, you know, through the grace of God, we work it out and we, we come together in a higher harmony as a byproduct of the way that we face this conflict, this extraordinary part of this extraordinary listening that you always talk about. And it's the, the beautiful thing there is that it doesn't equal a hundred percent. It's not like you and I come together, we disagree, we work it out and we come to a new harmony. It doesn't equal a hundred percent. The sum of the parts do not equal the whole. The whole is a thousand percent. That's the real resolution. We come, that's what I, that's the gift of Aikido to the world. It's an explosion of a higher way of coming together that is multidimensional. It opens up in other, uh, uh, other ways of functioning in the world. The barrier between where they're at and where they can be is, is so thin. It's such a, it's such a, right. the veil is like nothing. And it just takes a little bit of. That's my prayer. They're already turned on. They're already interested or something like that. It just, they need to connect it with that. They need to find some way to manifest it. And, and I'm hoping this helps them do that. I know you have to go. Yeah, but I just want to say, hey, Richard, it was great talking to you. Thanks for the invitation. Mm -hmm.